Huge shout out to the winner of the last video, DM me on Twitter to get your gift. If you guys want a gift in today's video, all you guys have to do is like this video, subscribe, post notifications on, and leave a nice comment with your gamer tag. Now in this video, it's all about Black Ops 2. So I'm showing you guys some Black Ops 2 gameplay all the way back 2012, 2013. We're going to be reacting to it. And at the very end, I'm going to keep it Black Ops 2 themed and get you guys a Cold War Black Ops 2 gameplay. This is such a throwback. Oh God, this is literally when you would put like a song in the beginning of any gameplay. And What's here we go. On, guys, James Beats here. Oh, the cringe. On my um, and as of recently, I watched- So this was the time where Justin Bieber, once again Justin Bieber was so all over the headlines for it. saying the N word. And, and I just so talked about it. I think at this time I was like 16, maybe 15 years he old. Posted racial slurs and stuff in a video and tmz got a hold of it and bro at this time i was so now. new now, at commentating is now i believe 20 years old and these videos are when he was 14 15 etc preach now i mean i'm not saying what he was doing wasn't wrong because right? it was definitely wrong and it wasn't right it was definitely wrong and it wasn't it right, wasn't right <laughs> but as a kid you make mistakes and i feel like now since he's getting older i think he's going to be more mature about it and actually atone from his mistakes and if he's not then i mean you know i feel like his career if it's not already going i feel like drain, i had no go idea deeper down at this time That's what i was saying I, about I was improvising but so hard as a person i'm not really gonna hold him against something that he did maybe what five years ago Yo, you hear that cancel yeah, culture? About five years ago. Take some notes. So, <laughs> this was me like I mean, ten years ago. Wrong, uh, I guess you can put the blame Some of y'all are grown adults. I'm not gonna hold them. Canceling people something over something that happened ago. over ten years ago. He's grown up. He's growing up. He's grown up. Bro, between right or wrong now, even though he's made many mistakes. Well, I'm not like a believer or anything like that. It's just like, oh my god, just a Bieber. He didn't do anything. Oh my wrong. god, you guys remember the believers? Oh, I can't you know, even get these off the screen. Doing, but, oh, this know, is so annoying. That's just me. But right here, I get the so, nuclear. Like it's just like one or two more kills. Um, people make mistakes as kids, but it just matters what you do as you grow there up. There we so, go. We got the nuke, the GMP, and then I got killed. My message in that video was, well, I don't even really know the message. I think it was that everyone makes mistakes as kids, but when you become an adult, that's what matters. So we're gonna go to the next one. All right, this one right here is really interesting because I'm gonna be putting myself on blast. This is talking about one of the first times I actually seriously partied, quote unquote partied, and I talked about it in the video. All it was was I just danced a little bit and, and you know, I, I was a little hyped because my friends were gassing me up. But let me just, let me play this and show you all the BS that I spewed. Guys, chain beats here, bringing you another commentary. First and, of all, uh, you know darn well in 2012, this, this is how every intro and started in these two topics one of them are important the second one is just a little story i hope you guys enjoy first of all so, i didn't even need to say that i don't know why know, i said it but right off the start um um the first topic i wanted to talk about was going to your first party <laughs> and for everybody i think the title established this party, i know it has to happen even if you're going with your best friend even if you're going with, like maybe your family girlfriend whatever it's i used like all this parties, to all think of what i was gonna say next you don't know what you're like doing and i'm not talking like party like birthday party or something like that i'm talking like i think we all know this enjoying yourself you know with your other peers and stuff so i'm gonna exclude the family members i'm gonna say like your friends your girlfriend, and i noticed back in 2012 and 2013 whatever whenever so, i would record i would constantly say um, you know to think of what party, i was gonna say next um i was actually very nervous and i didn't know what <laughs> to actually i can only imagine an um counter weird, like, what do you on this video do you party you have fun but you can say that but at the same time it's kind of different when you're actually experiencing it so i give i'm gonna give you guys some oh uh, there's a study easy tips on actually how to get comfortable in a party and how to i don't think anyone's gonna go to a gamer because to get tips on how to have fun and do well at a party hour to actually get used to what I'm doing and actually having fun because I was literally just one of those guys who were just sitting in the Ooh. chair talking to their friends. He got smoked. That, oh, I got shotgun. You're going to be known as like a boring loser or something like that. A boring loser. The party. So the first thing you want to do is think to yourself, I mustered up the courage. <laughs> See how long that took? 
so I needed my serve to actually do something. Literally thinking in real time, what should I say? <laughs> yeah, I was going to serve you no justice if you just mustered up the courage to go there, but you're not going to do anything about it. What are you going to say in the future? Like, hey, I went to a party and I did absolutely nothing. Yeah, that's why job. there's party Man, people and non-party yeah, people. That's, like, that looks, that's actually incredibly stupid to think about. So, um, the greatest thing um... I could say is honestly... <laughs> Let go of your ego, man. Like just let go of your ego, man. Do what you want to do. Because honestly, you never know. You may benefit from it. What does that so, mean? You're gonna get a kiss? It, get a date? Party for it. Um, by the way, it's um, 205 to. Uh, bro, I don't even know how many deaths I have. <laughs> so yeah, that's enough about the gameplay. I don't really care about it. Um, you mentioned the gameplay for like five seconds, bro. Was something that happened today, literally in the process of five minutes, I was walking to the store, right? So I walk into the store and I have to go do some grocery shopping. It's okay. whatever. I don't really care. I don't think we need to say this. that. And this girl walks in. She walks into the store with like the straightest face ever. I'm thinking she's pissed off or something. So... I'm not paying attention to her, but this guy has been staring. Uh, actually, you are paying attention to her because you knew she had a straight face. Pedophile? Because this girl's about two years younger than me. And I'm 16, so. That voice I'm crack! I'm 16, oh! so it's kind of weird that he was staring at her for that period of time. Now, suddenly, I just see her start walking out. And but like, again, I'm totally not paying attention. Back. I'm like, uh-oh. So that's why he was staring at her. And she was like, well, why do you want to see my bag so much? What's wrong with you? And right off the back, I'm like, okay, so now you're going to deny them a bag check when they're actually allowed to check your bag. I don't so know if that's true or not. I don't even think that's screaming. true. If it you is, me, I don't remember. You. You I probably Googled it. You need to get out of my business, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, oh my god, yo, this is one of those ghetto girls. She's gonna create a problem. Side so note, I got my heart broken by a ghetto girl at this time. Really hurt. The store because she tries to escape at first. She tries to run through the front door and they lock the front door. And I'm just sitting there like, what? What is going on? And she and they're saying, just open up your bag. We just want to see if the sunglasses are in there. And she's like, no, I don't have to do what you say. You don't even know me. Blah 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 blah. You don't even know me. Oh my god, yo, she really does have the sunglasses. That's the most because to this point, day calling the cop who like, steals Yo, sunglasses just over some sunglasses we're not even that worried about it we just want to know if it's in your bag or not and if it is we're just going to take it back like straight up like that's stupid if you're going to steal sunglasses and if you get caught on top of that that is pretty stupid that much like one you're stupid for stealing sunglasses like five dollar sunglasses five dollar sunglasses you hide it How stupid you're spitting facts right now chain look at this man trying to jump so, shot me they end up taking I just killed the them all easily, and, and my uh, haters, my motivator ran. Out. No, no, no. What is it called? The VSAT. The VSAT ran out. Saying, "Oh, by the way, the sunglasses weren't in there. He knows it now." So she ran out the door, and about a minute after that, he comes back with the sunglasses in his hand, saying, "All she had to do was give us the sunglasses." That was in the end of that. So the store owner banned her, and that was that. Point is, don't steal. <laughs> so the I moral mean, of your story yeah, was, was don't steal. Ending, but it was really kind of mm. funny, but it was so stupid. Like, people need to grow up and be mature about what 205 kills, so, though. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the chain beat this out. Trophy online. So, I wanted to actually keep this entirely BO2 themed. The only way for me to do that was also play a BO2 map. Now, I personally loved Slums. This map was the absolute truth for me. I thought I had it. It's not what I thought I had. What's my teammate doing? Can you help, buddy? Come on. Oh, got teammate got a hater. Is my motivator? Well, I mean, shoot. He may got a hit as my motivator. I'll gladly help out. Anyway, this theme. I thought it would make a lot of people happy. You know. Just to add on to the nostalgia. Why am I getting so many hit markers? Thank you very much.
Thank you very much. I'm okay. Authorizing hard tasking. Woo! This spawn trap is real. This is definitely peak memories right here. Yo, Jake Slayer is so mad. That's awesome.